What's going on YouTube crew? Noah from Kicking the Bass TV here with another video and this is the Mystery Tackle Box unboxing for the month of June. Um, haven't been getting these on time lately. We're getting them a little bit late so I'm getting them out to you a little bit later. Um, but let's go ahead and jump into the review. Um, so right when you open the box, this is exactly what it looks like right here. Um, so first bait that I'm gonna pull out. This is this Flat Belly Walker by Sibyl. Um, this is a top order bait. And I've actually used it and I have no complaints about it, guys. I'm pretty cool bait, similar to like a spook. Um, Sibyl makes, gosh, I cannot think of the name of it. Um, it's a top order bait that's more of curved. It's called the Something Walker. Um, it's a top order bait. And it's pretty, it, it, it runs really sick. It's um, kind of curved and it just walks really smooth and everything, more um, finesse presentation. Um, but yeah guys, it's similar to a spook, so it just has like a flat belly. Um, pretty cool bait. I believe that's in the fire tiger color as well. Um, I love Seville's baits, especially their swim baits are really good. Um, rattle trap's really great as well. Here's the reaction strike. Fathead Jr. Um, this is a four inch. And this is pretty much just like a regular swim bait. You can pair this on like a fish head, swim bait head, um, fish head spin anything like that um also you could just run it like at the top of the water column would be pretty cool as well you could throw it on a chatter bait pretty much anything just a regular swim bait um honestly for this is tennessee shadow color by the way um honestly if i was going to throw it i wouldn't throw it on like a chatter bait or something it's just a little bit bigger bro profile i like something a little bit lighter and everything and throw it on like a chatter bait but um on a fish head spin this wouldn't be too bad it's more of a swim bait on um, definitely on like just a regular swim bait head it'd be great guys when i opened the box when i saw this honestly i didn't know what to say um looks like leaves in a package it's called the viber grub i don't know where they're going with that here, here i'm gonna take one out i'm being completely open with this review guys You're seeing it. Yeah. Yep. 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 So I don't know. I don't know what I can do with that. To be completely honest, I mean, who knows? It might kill me. It might. It might catch a big fish. I don't know. I don't know. I guess you can just put it on like a little jig head or something. A little, a little shaky. I don't know if I have a hook that I fit that small, but. Yep, yeah, right there guys. <laughs> so definitely something different. I've never seen anything like that. Um, here's a little punch jig. This is in black and blue. This is your standard old jig right there. Um, get them at fishhogtackle.com. This is a standard old jig. As you guys know, I run Chattahoochee jigs, just really great jigs and general finesse jigs. Um, Here's those like fast clips um, by Mustad, and that's just so you can pretty much switch out your bait. Um, you tie that to your line, and then you can pretty much just clip on any bait you want really fast. Um, I don't use anything like that. I would just rather straight up tie it on. Um, but that's just those little like fast latch things. Honestly, I would rather just tie them on. That's just my personal preference. Um, here's some of those Eagle Claw laser sharps, and those are just those regular wide gap hooks. Um, you can see them right there. It's a two pack. Regular wide gap hooks. Here's a pretty cool bait right here. Um, Z Man, they make some pretty sick baits, I'm not gonna lie. Um, their Elastec stuff is super tough. Um, these are called the Bat Wings. These are two and three quarters of an inch. Um, got them right there. That'd be a cool little jig trailer for like a small little finesse jig. Um, cool little bait right there. And this is the crazy part about Z Man. I don't know if you guys have ever had any other plastics, and if you haven't, then when you see me do this, you're going to be like, what in the world? I mean, look at this. I mean, think, look at that. That's like a, I'm stretching that out 20 inches, and that's a 2-inch crawl right there. I kind of stretched out a little bit, but I mean, it won't break. That's the crazy thing about the Z-Man um, plastics, and I highly recommend them. I really like them. I mean, look at that, it's crazy. 
So you can really reuse them. You know, you have some of those baits. They're just really great baits in general, um, but they're really soft. Um, but it's not like I'm gonna stop using them because they break easy, but um, it's really neat that Z-Man does that. And they're super tough. I mean, it's crazy. It's insane that they can make something like that. It's called 10 times tough, the last tick. I'm not sure when they first started doing that, but um, I know it's been, it's been a while. But their baits are really tough if you're looking for something that's gonna last you a while. Um, so that's everything in the box. And of course, you got your Mystery Tackle Box sticker, and then where you get your first month's box for $5. Um, and then they have that little little game you can play. Honestly, I never did that last time. I should I should have done it. I might have won something. Never did it. Um and then got the Dibble Digest. And that's pretty much where it tells you some pretty cool information. Um, it's got some little ads in there, it gives you some little techniques. Um, pretty cool, pretty cool. That's all I like about Mystery Tackle Boxes stuff. Um, there's some Sibyl stuff on the back. Um, really great baits, guys. I love Sibyl, really great company. Um, love their products. So let's go ahead and go over the prices and everything. Um, so on the card, the Flat Belly Walker, which was the top order bait, the first one I went over uh, by Sibyl. It's going to be $6.99, so that's pretty fairly priced, guys. You know, you have some of those top order baits, like a, like a Sammy or a Gunfish or um, Wake Bait by Buckeye Lures, like stuff like that. I mean, they're going to cost around 20 bucks, 25 bucks, pretty crazy. Um, so for this one, only be like seven bucks. That's pretty good, guys. Similar to a Spooks price, so you can't go wrong with that. I'm not complaining. Um, the punch jig, just a regular standard jig in black and blue. Um, they're normally $4.99. The Fathead Junior, um, which is the, I believe it was five pack, four pack. Um, those are $5.90. Going on to the Bat Wings by Z-Man, the super stretchable things. Um, they're $2.75 for the three pack. And of course, when you buy them um, through Z-Man or through other sites, they're gonna come in a bigger pack. That's just a sample pack that they give the Mystery Tackle Box. Um, the Viber Grub, that weird looking leaf thing that I showed you is $2.50 um, and that's a four pack. And then you got the regular Y Gap hooks. Those are $1.06 for a two pack. That's fairly cheap for hooks. And then that Fast Latch Clip um, by Mustad, where you can just clip on the baits, is a dollar for a four pack. Pretty fairly cheap as well. Um, so this one's box is pretty good. I got a Sibyl bait. I really love Sibyl baits. So I will definitely be using that. Um, really love their stuff. Um, they got these cool little leaf looking things. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but pretty cool, pretty cool. All right guys, well that's um, the month of June mystery tackle box. Hope you guys enjoyed the quick little unboxing. Um, I would be doing MTB slams guys, but I just, I'm so, I'm so packed right now. Um, as you guys, most, most of you guys know, for the full month of July, I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing World Finals and Nationals, so it's just completely packed. I mean, I am slam packed the whole month. So, what I'm trying to do is knock out as many videos as I can, so I can schedule them throughout the whole month of July. Because I'm probably not gonna be doing any videos then. I'm gonna be recording videos. Don't get me wrong. There's gonna be tons of vlogs, tons of funny crap that you guys are gonna enjoy. Um, um Kentucky, I'm gonna be down there for nine nights. So I know you guys are going to see a lot of vlog action and you guys are really going to enjoy that. So definitely look forward to that. I know I might not be posting as much, but by the time August hits, you're going to see a lot of good stuff. Um, by that time, I'm sure I'm going to be posting some throughout July and stuff, but we'll get there. Um, if you haven't seen my latest tournament video, it was the Fat Sacks Outdoor Tournament. I actually ended up getting first place. Definitely check it out. I'll have the link at the end of this video. So thank you guys for watching. That is the June Mystery Tackle Box 2015. I'll see you guys next time.